hello everyone in this video i will explain usage of variable in scala uh, in scala there is no primitive data types all data types are object so when we declare a variable of any type like integer boolean float double so uh, we are actually creating a object so there are no primitive data types in scala now uh, let's open your uh, terminal now in this terminal just write scala so here uh, i'm going to show you how to declare a variable so in scala you can use where or well so first of all we are going to see usage of where so in order to declare a variable what you have to write you have to write where then you have to write name of variable let's say i am taking x and after colon you need to write data type what is the data type of this variable so in scala we are having byte short int long float double boolean so let's take integer variable so that's why i am writing int and here whatever value you want to assign so let's say i want to assign 12 so a variable we just created name x the data type integer and value is 12 now we can change this value let's say i'm changing this value to 23 so as the name implies variable the value of the value of variable can be changed now there is one more way to create a variable that is well y int 120 now if you are using well it means you are creating a constant uh, we can assign a value to this type of variables which are actually constant only one time so if you try to reassign another value let's say i want to reassign 23 so scala will generate one error because well actually used to create constant whereas whereas used to create variables uh, now uh, there is one more concept like uh, let's say I'm uh, uh, creating a variable jet and I don't want to specify any data type I am simply uh, simply I am putting a value like 1.2 so if you can see uh, Scala has ability to automatically figure out what's the data type of a variable by checking this value so we are assigning a real value to variable z and by default it is taken as double so this concept is known as type inference like scala can figure out what's the data type of a variable by checking value assigned to that variable thank you very much for watching